Hello and welcome to Walking Bible. Today we will talk about that Jesus is the light of this world. God is light. And let me explain it for you with this small experiment. This glass of water represents God. God is light. There is no darkness in him at all. He is holy. He is righteous. He created mankind in his image. We were perfect. We were righteous. But sin came into the world. It separated us from God. Sin is in its essence the very opposite of God. Whereas God is light, sin is darkness. God is truth. Sin is lies. God is order. Sin is chaos. God is life. Sin is death. God leads us right. Sin leads us astray. Sin sets itself up against God and wants to take God's place. Sin made man want to become like God, to be self-sufficient, to go his own way and to hide from God even. Sin contaminated us when we invited sin. Sin separated us from God. Sin cannot coexist with God. Light and darkness cannot coexist. Chaos and order cannot coexist. Lies and truth cannot coexist. Even a small lie is still a lie. Sin contaminated mankind, the entire creation. It thwarted everything and we still live with the consequences. But the good news is that God is still light because darkness cannot overcome light. And God sent his son into this world 2000 years ago. And Jesus says in John 8, 12, I am the light of the world. Whoever follows me will never walk in darkness, but will have the light of life. Jesus is the light of God. The light of God penetrates the darkness and absorbs the darkness. And thanks to the sacrifice on the cross, sin is defeated. And the subsequent resurrection confirms the total victory over sin and death. And when we invite Jesus, the light of this world, into our life, God takes away the darkness and absorbs it. We become righteous thanks to Jesus inside of us. And one day, God will eradicate sin and darkness totally and completely. There will be no death no more, no darkness no more. And this is our hope for the future. When Jesus comes back to this earth as the light of this world, he will put everything in order and he will judge sin and darkness. And the darkness and the sin will forever be eradicated and expelled. And God will be the light of the world. We put this verse, John 8 verse 12, to music. And why don't you take the chance to memorize it so that you will always remember that God is light. And if you let God into your life to be the light of your life, he will take away the sin and make you righteous. God bless you and hope to see you soon. Bye. John 8 verse 12. I love